wishing you were mine Glowing neon red with feelings I deny More than just a friend I'm ready to ignite, ready to ignite Bumps every time I try to catch your eye Hold me in suspense and take me by surprise I'm so high on the smoke, you blow into my mind Blow into my mind I can't explain it, caught up in your heat wave that mysterious intro pretty cool right now what's even more mysterious me not showing my face right now because i look like the human embodiment of a garbage can anyway my friend luke sent me this roll of sinistel black and white double x tryout so go follow him on instagram and send him a personal message that says thanks luke you're the best because I said so. This is the first time in a long time I've shot black and white film. The only other stocks I've tried were HP5 and some Kodak my friends at Vaughn's Photo sent me a while back that were predisposed to some pretty interesting drunken stupor. Anyway, other than that, I don't normally shoot black and white. I prefer color, but I've always wanted to switch things up and try grayscale again for a while now. If you don't know, Sinistel Black and White Double X is a classic stock left relatively unchanged since its release in 1959 for still and motion picture use. In my experience with this film, I can see that motion picture quality they talk about. Honestly, I wish I wouldn't have used a point and shoot to try this for the first time because I feel like a lot of the shots could have been a lot better if I had more control over the exposure, but it is what it is. I like the contrast and the grain that you get with this film. I think it captured light in a unique way, if that makes any sense. I'll definitely be shooting this again in the future. Uh, supposedly, you're supposed to meter differently depending on lighting conditions, ISO 250 under daylight and 200 under tungsten. I didn't do any of that or test that out. Um, I'm sorry, <laughs> but let me know if you shot this film before and what you think. I will definitely be trying it again and will probably make another video giving my overall thoughts of everything that I think about it. So, thanks for watching. Okay, bye. <laughs>